God bless you, my beloved. Thank you for joining us. We are Abundant Grace Church, and I'm Bishop Ramon De Maria, and I'm the senior pastor of the church. For prayer or information concerning our ministry or to donate to this ministry, please email me at abundant.grace at att.net. Our message title today is, Who Are You Depending On? Our scripture will be from Psalm 121 and verse 2. My help comes from the Lord. My beloved, if you desire to do God's will, but don't draw on his power, you will fail in spite of your skill, your connections, and your resources. You must develop an increasing sense of dependence on God. Now, my beloved, you can't just sit on the sidelines expecting him to do everything for you. You have been called to step out in faith, obey his instructions, then trust him for the right results. God's sufficiency should become your goal, not self-sufficiency. This calls for praying. Lord, I am tempted to do things in my own strength, but I don't like the results. Teach me to strive for excellence, not omnipotence, to maximize my talents and minimize my ego. Remind me that you will never give me an assignment that doesn't require obedience, commitment, and your enabling grace. The psalmist cried, my help comes from the Lord. Think, my beloved, if he is Lord of every situation and he has promised to help you, then your victory is assured. It's when you think you can do it without him or with limited input, from him that you get into trouble. Jesus said in John chapter 5 and verse 19, the son can do nothing of himself but what he sees the father do. Jesus knew he couldn't do anything apart from the father, so he never bothered to try. We, on the other hand, quote the verse, without me you can do nothing. That is John 15 and 5. Then go out and act like it all depends on us. And what happens? We fall flat on our face. So my beloved, please learn to stop regularly and ask yourself, what am I depending on? Then answer it and say, you Lord, and only you. Let us pray. Father God, in Jesus' name, many times we try to do things in our own strength and we fail. Teach us to continue to trust you, believing by faith that our help comes from you. Thank you for this time of prayer as we pray in the name of our Savior and Lord Jesus Christ, to whom be glory, power, and majesty, now and forever. Amen. So my beloved, go out, tell others about Jesus Christ. But before you do, remember to pray and ask God for his help in the name of of our Savior, Lord Jesus Christ, and depend on him totally. God bless you and go with God.